if sharks disappeared. Written and illustrated by Lily Williams. A healthy ocean is home to many different kinds of animals. They can be big, like a whale, tiny, like a shrimp, and even scary, like a shark. Even though sharks can be scary, we need them to keep the oceans healthy. Unfortunately, due to overfishing, many shark species are in danger of extinction. And that can cause big problems in the oceans, and even on land. This is a healthy ocean. It's a balanced environment where many different animals and plants thrive. The ocean is home to a lot of creatures. Big, small, slimy, cute, and scary. Sharks have helped keep our oceans balanced for about 450 million years. Over that time, they evolved into the more than 400 different species that exist today. Sharks are apex predators, which means they are at the top of the food chain in their ecosystem, the ocean. Losing an apex predator species can cause devastating effects in an environment. Today, roughly between one-fourth and one-third of the shark species are vulnerable to extinction because of overfishing. What could happen if this continues and sharks disappear altogether? If sharks disappeared, the ocean would no longer be balanced. Although different species have different diets, most sharks typically eat sick, slow, or weak prey, leaving the healthy animals to reproduce. If sharks disappeared, the population of seals, sea lions, and other pinnipeds would potentially explode. At higher populations, they would eat more and more fish, and eventually, once there weren't any fish left, they'd starve and die out as well. If fish and pinnipeds disappeared, plankton, which is what many fish that are lower on the food chain eat, could quickly grow out of control. That could make the ocean a thick sludge. Nothing could survive in this water. If the ocean became unlivable, Many species of land animals that rely on the ocean for food, such as seabirds and polar bears, could starve and die out. The loss of those animals could cause still more species farther inland to die out. This pattern of cause and effect, called a tropic cascade, could spread like a wave across countries and continents until animals around the globe were affected, from bees to birds to bears, and eventually to us. All species depend on one another to survive by keeping our planet's ecosystem in balance. And luckily today, Sharks still exist. Sharks inhabit all the oceans on Earth. If we remember that we are all connected, and if we work together, sharks and our whole planet as we know it will thrive. And maybe we'll see that what once seems so scary isn't so scary after all. You can help save sharks by being a conscious consumer and telling your government representative you want better protection of sharks and marine life. Let them know you want regulations of bycatch and fishing practices for the fishing industry. Thanks for listening and don't forget to subscribe. Want to check out the last story we read? Here's the link! Do you have a favorite book that you want read aloud? 
leave it in the comments below.